is mine. And this is how I choose to celebrate in a night of worship and a night of honor. My name is Nadine Blair and I'm <clears throat> years old. <laughs> And I thank God for all that he has done in my life. I invite you to come with us on this journey. We're going to lift up the name of Jesus. Listen, Psalm 18 says, I will love thee, O Lord, my strength. You never feel weak yet? Don't. The Lord is my rock, my fortress, my deliverer, my God, my strength in whom I will trust. He's my buckler and the horn of my salvation, my high tower. I can run into him and be saved. Later on in the verse, it says, I will call on the Lord who is worthy to be praised. So shall I be saved from my enemies. Well, guess what? This is your time to kick off your shoes and uh, let out your hair or your wig, whatever, and give God some praise. The first song says, open the eyes of my heart, Lord. I want to, I need to, I must see you.
We want to see you high and lifted up. Now, this journey will take you back in time a little bit and, you know, forward and some new songs and stuff. And I can't be New Testament Church of God, glory to God. And don't give you some whole time, glory to God's song. Now, this song, boy, I tell you, I love it. I love the thought of being overshadowed and kept under the canopy of God's grace and love. So make we go down the old lady. What do you call this now? Yeah. Because 
Sometimes we find ourselves in some situations that we should not have been. And then because of the disobedience, we end up trapped and almost died. That was my testimony. You so hear it. But he was there all the time. He was there all the time. I know so the song go, but he was there. <laughs> and I know he'll guide me all the way. All the way. I'm going to sing a song now that I used to sing as a little girl, a littler girl. <clears throat> and um, it was a period in my life that I was known for different songs. And this particular one, I absolutely loved. And I had the opportunity to sing it at a huge stadium in Texas at the International um, New Testament. No, well, it's the Church of God Worldwide. And I remember the night before, because... I'm used to singing before a crowd, but that crowd is another type of crowd. It just big. And I remember the night before I was sleeping and there was a dream and, and there was an attack on my vocal cords. And I was in the room with my dad and my mom. My dad jumped out of his sleep, speaking in tongues and just, yeah. And I had to go on the stage in front of all these people and sing about that man called Jesus you see arrows will come weapons will form and I don't know where that one came from but I know where it went and I know that this champion of love he covered me then and he's still covering me now we call him the all time undisputed undefeated champion of love this 
went through something that many of us go through. He saw a need and he wanted to fix that need. And he went to the king and he got permission and everything and he went and he started to rebuild the walls. And then he got the, his Sanballat and Tobias. Anybody have any of them in your workplace or at your home or even at your house, in your community, in your church. Somebody who just don't want to see you go forward. Stand still and see the salvation of God. Watch him work it out for you. Watch him turn your situation around. Know that he is with you and don't fight. You see, because... The very person that you're going to take that war on to. They're going through their own battle. They are not the enemy. We wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities and powers. Rulers of darkness. And in Nehemiah chapter 6 verse 8, in the NIV version, that's where I got this theme from. Nehemiah said, you know, here are these people, God, and they're doing all these things. And I don't know what to do. And then he said those three words, but I prayed. Have you prayed about your situation? Do you know that this champion of love is the mighty God who created heaven and earth and is able to take you through the storm? I was on my way to an event the other day and I looked up in the sky and was like, wow, God is so big. What a mighty God. And as I drove to the event, I got a song. And I'm so sorry for the keyboard player because as I reach, I said, come, come, come. I hear a song in my head. I'm going to teach you the song. And I started. And I sang the song at the event. Well, thank you to my lovely musicians, Latoya HD and um, my musicians. I'll introduce them later. We came up with a new arrangement and I trust that you will enjoy it. But 
I trust that you will know this mighty God is fighting for you. What a mighty God.
to You're the rock that I can run into 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 You're the rock that I Your vantage point is a rock that is higher than you. Do you know your God? Do you know your God? Nobody loves like We were in studio one day, myself, Sabrina, Christina, who's here, um, LJ, and we were getting ready to go live, and the Lord just dropped this song, just like that. He's God. He was God then, and he's still God now. And when we doubt him, it's almost like we're saying, when I really believe, say, my God. God, you, know, you really need some help, so we're going to help you. Let's not doubt him. Let's put away the fear because God has not given you a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. Do you know this, God? You are God. this one. You turn storms into gardens. You speak peace in my sad days. You
to do. There's a source that we can run to. He is the all encompassing. He is what? God in the mountain top, God in the valley. if we really understand what it means because you see when we sing and we say you are God it, it, it also calls us to kind of act a certain way around him you know kind of have this thing to know that he's going to work it out so also as a little girl I used to sing a song another song and this one is called um, Shepherd of My Heart <laughs> I'm giving you a little history of this year old girl, I can't say 55 year old girl. I, was, I started singing when I was 10 years old and officially in a group we were called um, Chariot Riders and then we, we, we changed to Celestial Gems and our biggest tour was from Atlanta, Georgia and driving down, stopping at different cities and going all the way down to South Florida. That was huge for us. And here's a little thing for gospel ministers. We used to go to different churches and sing at their youth fellowship and all of that. And we didn't think much of it. We just wanted to sing for God and worship and lead persons in worship. This song became dear to me because I needed to learn to trust God. And maybe somebody out there you are having a struggle to trust God. So my brother, Oti, who has been playing for me from my idea knee, well, his eye probably was at his toe then, <laughs> but um, 
we're going to try and do this one for you. Just the first verse, the second verse, and then the chorus. Okay? <clears throat> and pray it will bless you. You see, the God that you are trusting is in Mekyo. So I must say to you, don't worry. Don't fret. Here we go. I start to wonder like a lamp that's gone astray I'll trust in you shepherd of my heart you're the beacon of my night you're the sunlight of my day within your arms I can know your loving ways let the cold winds blow and let the storms rage all around I'll trust in you shepherd of chorus one more time because somebody is watching and I'm feeling you're pulling me with your pain and it is so hard and you just need to remember that God is with you can you trust him can you just just fall back and, and just rest in him you're the beacon of my life you're the sunlight of my day. I can rest within your arms. I can know your loving way. So let the cold winds blow. Let the storms rage all around. I'm gonna trust you shepherd of my heart I'm gonna trust in you shepherd of my heart I'm gonna trust in you shepherd of mighty hand 
When the oceans rise and the thunders roar, I will soar with you above the storm. Father, you are king over the flood, so I will be still and know you are God. I will be still, know you are God. Let me tell you something before I go to the second verse. You see in the storm, the winds go around and they're heavy and they're messy and they're dark and they're rough. And there's something that they call the eye of the storm. And in the eye of the storm is where there is peace. So the reconnaissance plane can go up and over and into the eye. And then they can fly in the eye. No matter if it's a category 5, 10. They don't have 10. But you know, the strongest storm, they can fly in the eye. <laughs> and they can figure out what is happening and how the storm will go. My God. God is saying to you today, but you prayed. He's saying to you, you had depression. You're walking in sadness. You walk, your family let you down. Your husband let you down. Your wife let you down. Your worker let you down. Everything is going wrong, but you prayed. And he is keeping you in the eye of the storm. COVID is a storm. All kind of things are going around. But you're going to find rest in the King of Kings, in the champion of love, in the mighty God, in the God of yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Would you join me and sing the little song with me? Hear the second verse now. Find the rest, my soul. Yes, God. In Christ alone. You have to talk to yourself. Don't indicate you have to talk to yourself. Know his power. I lift you up. I lift you up, Jesus. In quietness and trust. Oh, but when the oceans rise and the thunders roar, see, I will call on you. You'll take me above the storm. See, Father, you are king over the flood. So I will be still, know you. Our God, yes, I will be still. Know you. One more thing, one more thing before I go back to the chorus. Now, listen. Now, the difference between the eagle, the eagle stretch out his wings, so and him do so, <laughs> and the wind is buttering and moving underneath him. But the eagle uses the storm to take him higher, Woo! and so the storm get rough. Him go higher what storm are you facing are you gonna let it butter butter you and you have to flap your wings so lord god almighty i pray that you will find your prayer room i pray that you will find your prayer closet i pray that you will find us a praise in the days of the storm you must know your god he's coming through for you you must know that your god is able to see you through you must know that your god is standing up He's calling your name when the ocean, when the ocean, hey, I will soar with you, I will. Father, you are king, Father, you. Over the flood, so I'm gonna rock back in you, God. I will. Fret. Never let it go. I will be still. I will be still. I know you. One more time with the chorus. Could you sing it for that mother who is hurting? Oh my God. He's hearing you. Still, I know our God. 
worship you, Almighty God. There is none like you. I worship you, O Prince of Peace. what I long to do. I give you praise for you are my righteousness which you over seeking. I worship you almighty There is none like you. That's how I just flow, just flow. Mm. There is none like you. No one else can touch my heart like you do. And I can search throughout Turn a chill, Lord, and find there is none like you. There is none like you. Oh, no. No one else can touch my heart like you do. I could search throughout it niche Lord and find there is none there is none there is none like you Pastor Joseph wrote this is my desire to honor you, Lord, with all my heart, I worship you. And all I have within me, I give you praise. And all I have, all that I adore, is in you. May this be your prayer today. Lord, I give you my heart. I give you my soul. I live for you alone. And every breath that I take, every moment I'm away, Lord, have your way in me. Every breath that I take, every moment I'm away. Lord, have your way in me. Christina Bradley. I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided 
to follow I'm gonna follow Jesus No turning back No turning back The cross before me The world behind me The cross before me For me, the world's behind me. No turning back, I have decided. No turning back, I have decided. No turning back, no turning back, no turning back. No turning back. No turning back. Hallelujah. My prayer is that you were reminded of the God that you serve, this awesome King who is so very interested in what you're going through. He knows. You can't hide from him. I have seen the mountaintop and have been in the valley. And this God comes searching after me. Oh, it's on go. No mountain you could. He's just running after you and he wants you to run after him. Running down. But I prayed my life has been filled with a lot of happy days I remember my lowest point was because of disobedience <laughs> I mentioned that earlier and because of anxiety and I was listening to a message the other day from Apostle Joshua Selman and he was saying in the beginning God in the beginning, God, whose four words that start the Bible. And the point he was making was, in the beginning of everything you do, put God first. Would you make that your prayer now? In the beginning of the job seeking, I'm putting God first. In the beginning of the husband or the wife seeking, I'm putting God first. In the beginning of whatever, I'm putting God first. But I prayed. Will you pray? I want to pray for you before we wrap things up with this last song and introduce the band. Father, I thank you for this opportunity. Kind of different, no? But God, it was all about you and it was all for you. And I pray that those who are watching, if there's somebody on the verge of suicide, that we, we, we crumple that spirit of suicide, we crumple that spirit of depression, we crumple that spirit that says, I'm not good enough. God says to tell you, you are good enough. God of this universe, champion of love, mighty God who overshadows us, you are God and you are in control. We want to see you high and lifted up in our lives. So take over. Take over, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Father, I pray against every evil spirit, every person who is, who is using evil methods to pull down their family members, pull down their communities. I pray in the name of Jesus that they will find strength to stand on the rock that is higher than they are. You got this because God has you. Be strong, be resilient, be courageous, and pray. Praise God. So, they don't know this yet, so I'm going to tell them what they're going to do. So, we're going to sing the last song, but I'm going to introduce each of them, and they're going to play. So, who am I going to start with? Who am I going to start with? Uh, no. Over here um, is my brother from long time, Othney Lewis. In a north of play, play sitting. Yes. Yeah. 
in that. All right. And then over here we have Brinton. Yeah. <laughs> really? All right, before it team done. Brinton. Hey. Brinton was there. Brinton was there when we, we wrote Waymaker. Yeah, I'm full of joke. Anyway, on the guitar, Brand Br 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 Brandon. Come in, run, band manager, leader, everything, organizer, mixer. Over there on the drums, Wendell Lawrence. Love you for life. Joseph, I can call on you anytime. Love you. Christina, love you. Courtney behind the camera and John. Bobby over there, alternative music limited. Charmaine, who else? Makeup by O'Neill. No talent, just fabulous. Dress by. Um, oh, Red, Red Divine Wear. Thank you. Red Divine Wear for my Yes, my lovely dude. So, here's a reminder that you shall live and not die. A song written by Dean Smith, Pastor Dean Smith. Continue to keep it. Yeah, man. Everything cool. Everything, Chris. Everything cool. Everything, Chris. Go! Jehovah. 
Holy Spirit, all the men, just to declare over your mouth, prophesy over your home. Here we go. I shall not, I shall not. Come on. 